Okay, today we're going to be installing the new super bright LEDs, LED deck step light. You can see there's the model. This one is a natural light 12 volt unit. It's also the rectangular one, they're a the round one and a 120 volt units and warm white ones available. So it comes with uh, all the necessary hardware and here's the light. No trim plate. That's uh, a secondary option. Got your low voltage wires here. Silicone uh, weatherproofing. So we're just going to mount it in this step right here. You'll see it in a minute. Uh, and I'm just coming off of my existing landscape lighting system here. It's going to be pretty easy. Probably take me about uh, 15 minutes. These are the trim plate options. This one's a louvered age brush copper uh, I'm actually going to be going with the black louvered version because the rest of my landscape lights are uh, black so I'll be installing it right here so that it shines on the, the step below and you can see that's my last pagoda I have them all surrounded around there's my transformer just your standard uh, Malibu transformer and I wanted to show you how convenient this, this will be for me since I've got the end of my landscape line right here I'm just gonna come right off of that and right into the deck light which will go under there and I'll fish it through right there let's get started with the measurements three inch by two and a half inches so I'm gonna do a two and a half inch hole saw right uh, off center a little bit by half inch. So this is 38 inches. I'm going to go at 18 and a half inches here and hopefully steer clear of that four joist. The hole cannot be bigger than uh, these four screws. That's what we'll mount into. That's for mounting into an outlet box. But we're just going to use these four outer screws. So my trace is going to be that size hole. Okay, so we knocked that out. We got our hole, but we need to make uh, this square. And I'm going to go along with my Dremel, a general bit for wood cutting, and uh, go along the trace here for the square. Okay, so we got our hole cut out. Okay, so I'm going to be tapping into my 12 volt AC landscape system for my transformer. This is the end of the, the line. Uh, since it's AC, we won't have to worry about polarity. That's positive, negative, or other terms would be uh, just the wire color. Don't have to worry about that. So, screw the wire nuts on, nice and tight. Now I'm tapped into the circuit. I'm gonna strip these wires. And we're gonna fish, fish it from out of the hole. There you go folks, that's a lit up light. There's the end of my circuit. The wires I haven't hid yet. Going to the deck light. Okay, now we're gonna mount the, the light into the wood. Um, since this light can be mounted into a junction box, it comes with uh, screws that are designed for, uh, machine screws that are designed for mounting it in a junction box and it has the silicone ring for them. I'm just going to use wood screws and mount it into uh, my wood deck. And this step you can uh, level to ensure levelness. Okay, and uh, you can see here's one of the options, the, uh, the louvered aged copper. I decided to go with black again. Um, here's the window option. You can see what that would look like. Probably put out maximum light output. But uh, I kind of like the louvered. It's only going to put light where it needs it, downward. Uh, should be plenty enough to know that there's a, a stair there if you needed to see that. And the trim comes with 
two screws finished to the uh, the color of the trim plate and that mounts to the light not to the wood okay so mounting the trim plate or the face plate to uh, the light you may just want to use a screwdriver for this 